it's Reagan and welcome back to another video. I'm sure you can tell already by the title of this video, but I'm so excited to say that Clay and I, surprise, bought a house. And here's Clay now to show off his excitement. Yay. <laughs> this is something that has been in the process behind the scenes for many, 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 many months and honestly took many, many, many years in the lead up. Clay and I have always dreamed of coming back to Austin, Texas. This is where we want to raise our family. We always knew we wanted to buy a house here and we only temporarily left for like jobs and things in hopes that we'd be able to come back and buy a house, which I'm so happy to say we did. I will say we did not time the market oh so well. Um, the actual process of getting a house was, let's just say, pretty terrible. <laughs> it took a really long time, which is why I didn't really like talk about it um, until we actually secured something. That being said, the house that we were able to get, we love so much. It has so much character and something about it too that we love. It's actually uh, like lots of families have lived here for a really long time. The last owners lived here for over 20 years, raised their family here, and just that sort of legacy is something that we're really excited about. The house itself is also older, so it has a lot of character and a bit of quirkiness to it. Um, the house has had like different extensions put on through its lifetime, so the layout's a little fun, which we actually really, really enjoy. Uh, we do plan to make some cosmetic updates throughout the years that we live here, but for the most part, we love it so much. We do plan to paint, but other than that, pretty much everything is going to stay just about the same. But just wanted to say hi, we're so excited. Welcome to the Empty House Tour. I'm excited to probably not move again for a very long time and uh, kind of start our next chapter in this house. I will say disclaimer, if you hate our house, that's fine, but don't tell me. <laughs> Please don't tell me, we love it here and we're really happy. All's well that ends well. All the other houses we lost, all the, the process of trying to buy a house right now, it all ended up okay because we really love where we ended up. But without further ado, let's go ahead and start, ow, the tour. All right, so starting off on the tour, we have this front room. So this I think was used as like the living room in the old house, but I have big plans for the space because I'm going to make it my library. This is going to be like a front sitting library room. So it's really cool because it has a lot of great walls. It has a really fantastic window. And then I would say my favorite part of this room is actually this fireplace, which is for sure the focal point and something we're really excited to have. Um, something cool is that this mantle is actually from 1890 and has been in the house for a long time and has been with the past two families that have lived here so obviously we're going to maintain it as well we think it's really beautiful and antique and we love the kind of character it adds to the space but this is the front room um it's great lots of light gonna be full of lots of books but then you know you just flow into the next room flowing into the next area from the front room you have the dining room and the kitchen this is kind of part of where one of the extensions actually starts and you can see it with like this beam up here they like push out this wall slightly um in the front you have some really great storage this is going to be our pantry area which is also very exciting but then first over to the side we have the dining room which we have never had a functioning dining room before so this is very exciting we have never had like a table and chairs well i think we have but it's been at least four years since we've had like a table and chairs and haven't just been eating on our couch so this is such an upgrade. <laughs> and then swinging to this side is the kitchen. And so this kitchen is super cool. There's so much light coming in from the backyard. There's so much light in this kitchen, which we love. And there's also like beautiful windows into the backyard, which is really, really cool. The kitchen itself is super functional. We think the layout is great. I think we're gonna like do some painting and stuff. But other than that, we really like everything under these appliances. I have a gas stove. I'm gonna be searing so many things in this house. You have no idea. And then, you know, fridge, island, so fancy, we got an island. And um, yeah, that's the kitchen space. And then shifting through here, we have like, like this hallway because we're going into like another extension. This was put on in like the 70s, uh, where this was put on in like the 2000s. Uh, but again, we have these really cool windows and now we're moving into, Clay's my cameraman, the family room, the living room, where we're gonna watch TV. This is this space, it's really cozy. It can be perfect, obviously, for a couch. And that's exactly what we're gonna do here. I'm gonna put my desk and then a couch. You can even see the outline of the couch on the ground. Then turning to the other side of the room, TV is gonna go here. We have this really handy closet. 
you'll love to see it, storage. And uh, my old camera just died, so if you see like a slight change in video, that's why. Uh, you, try to, you try to come prepared, but something happens always. But yeah, this is the family room space, lots of space for hanging out, movies, vibing, the like. And then guess what? We're gonna go through here, and this is one of two bathrooms. That's right, Clay and I now have two bathrooms. I guess we had two bathrooms in our awesome apartment and it was so nice, so we're happy to be able to have more than one again. So this is kind of like the guest bathroom, the bathroom that'll serve all the other rooms that aren't like, the, you know, the main bedroom, if you will. Because of the size of the bathroom, it's kind of hard for Clay and I to fit to film, so I'm just going to handheld and talk through it, but it's super cute, has a little pedestal sink, has a toilet, has a bath shower, so super handy. Tile is, you know, tile. And then a really great thing is actually all of this storage in here. So lots of room for linens and all sorts of bathroom related things. We like it, it's super cute. There's Clay, there's me. All right, there's the bathroom. Then shifting through the bathroom, through the other way, you have the front sitting room and the kitchen. But turn around and I will give Clay the camera back. Um, we have the two other bedrooms that aren't the primary bedroom. This is the first of the two bedrooms and this is actually gonna be Clay's office and like gaming room. Um, it's really nice, it's a good size. Lots of space for like a desk or a bed eventually and all of that. It's a cute character. A lot of overlays, but there's great storage in here. We also love the floors. We have like original hardwood floors through most of the home, which is like really exciting for us. Um, and it just has like a lot of charm and character. Clay is currently standing in a closet, but this is our second bedroom. Our house actually has three whole bedrooms and this is going to be our guest bedroom to, you guessed it, house our guests. My mom is already so excited because she has a designated place to sleep. But this room is slightly bigger than the other bedroom. We'll very easily fit a nice bed in here. It'll be really cozy and cute. We're excited to kind of like repaint and put our own like stamp on the home. But again, the bones we just love so much. So this is the second bedroom. And guess what? We're almost done with this tour, MTV crib style. We're going into the last bedroom, the primary bedroom in the house, and it's down this long, beautiful hallway. So let's go. So the cool thing about the primary bedroom is it's actually part of an extension. So you'll notice that we had to like step down and stuff, but the ceilings are super high and there's lots of beautiful natural light. We have really cool like sliding glass doors and like windows everywhere. So there's just really beautiful light. And you can even see on the side of the wall here that this was like the old exterior of the home and they like made it a wall, which is pretty neat. Uh, but yeah, this room is super well sized. Obviously we'll be able to fit all of our furniture in here. We love just like the vibe of the space and the uniqueness and kind of the architectural diversity, let's call it, of the space. But this is the primary bedroom, but now moving into the last space in the house, which is the primary bathroom. So let's just give you a gander. So the bathroom currently doesn't have doors, so that is something we'll work to add later on. But for now we have these really lovely curtains. But it's kind of just like one long space. And I'm just gonna take camera duties away from Clay again. But first off, we have the toilet. And then we have a really nice and spacious double vanity. You have me, hello. And then going over here, we have the shower, which is honestly pretty large. Like it's a lot deeper than you would think initially, but it's like pretty large shower. And then, we have um, some more bathroom storage, which I will probably use for closet storage too, because also we have this really ginormous walk-in closet. This is probably the biggest closet I've ever had. So that is ultra, ultra exciting. And that is basically our entire house. Clay, what's your favorite room in the house? I really like the front room. I think yeah. it's a cool place and will look really cool once it has your books and your library in there and the chair. Nice. And then just a quick peek of outside the house, which is honestly, I would say, the selling point for Clay and I because the backyard is truly beautiful. The previous owners just put so much love and care back here and it really just shows. You have this beautiful decking, beautiful mature trees, 
a fire pit. I'll show you guys. I mean, don't you just want to spend all day back here? We even have a little deck off the primary bedroom. It's just so beautiful. We're gonna put a grill over there. Clay's gonna become a grill master, Bobby Flay. And uh, there's also a deck off the kitchen. So I would say the backyard is my favorite part of the, like, the whole house but also excited about the prospect of a library. And that is our empty house tour. I tried to start with it being pretty professional and then it just kind of turned into a vlog style empty house tour, but I hope you guys enjoyed. We're moving in like literally right now. So moving vlogs coming up very, very soon and uh, we're so excited. Thank you guys for tuning in and uh, we'll see you soon with another one soon. Goodbye.